I'm a professional photographer by trade. Um, I'm happily married to Willem. I have a little boy who starts in grade 4 this year. He's 9 years old. Very excited about what the new year holds for him. I was 11 years old when my grandfather um, introduced me to photography and he had a camera that he gave me exclusive use of and it was a film camera back in the day and just after that I had gone on a school tour and my mom and dad had given me a little um, film camera as a present and that's where I started um, with photography and having and gaining an interest in it and for me photography just means capturing a moment that that you'll never be able to have over again and it's the only memory that you have of people and of moments that they pass. People who strive to make a difference in their community and community not being a town or, or a country even but starting to make a difference with the people that they surround themselves with, be it um, family members, be it at the workplace. People who really go out to, to inspire others by leading by example, by trying to make a small difference in a person's life. Um, something that may seem insignificant to, to most people, but to that person it actually makes a world of, of difference. So I would imagine anyone who lives to make a difference in another person's life. I'm a proudly Springs girl. I was born in Springs um, and I haven't left. So, <laughs> so I've been a resident for a good on 35 years. The fact that Springs is so rich with history, um, just for example, the Art Deco buildings, to me that is something to be so proud of. And a while back, my, even my nine-year-old son, he's noticed that there's something different about the buildings. And I mean, how proud can we be um, of knowing that we're second in the world with the, with the number of buildings that we have in a single town? It's something to be really proud of and something to celebrate. I thoroughly enjoy the people of Springs, just seeing how innovative they are um, by taking with what they have and using those talents to create something big. And there's so many fabulous people that have come from Springs and have made it in, in the world and be able to say that we're from a little town called Springs on the far east end. <laughs> the one thing that I can truly say of Springs and why I'm so proud of being able to call myself a proudly Springs girl is the fact that if there's a crisis, and it doesn't matter where the crisis is, Springs people have, they have the heart of just pulling together and making something work. Um, a couple of years ago I was involved in a mission in Rustenburg when, um, when people really needed someone just to pull together and to assist another town. And literally Springs people pulled together and they made a difference in a town of people that they would probably never even meet. And that to me is just so significant and just so special. I would imagine I would like to be a voice for young girls especially, um, to encourage them and to encourage women and to help them understand that they can be whatever they put their minds to. They can achieve any goal that they would like to achieve and the world is literally as big as what they make it.